This is AIR. Artists in Residence Broadcasting. Coming to you once a week from New York City. Hello, it's another weekend, and in case you don't know, I'm John Cullum, and this is Emily Franco. My I think I am. Yeah, well, I hope you are. We are about to do another post for my blog, Amps Talkery, and I didn't tell John the subject. I like to spring it on him. Uh-oh. This is actually not a very difficult subject, just a little tricky. The subject is jealousy, jealousy of other actors. And why I ask that is because we were watching Peter O'Toole like the binoculars. You were just watching every single yeah. move he made. Yeah. And I said, why are you watching him so much? <laughs> and you said... Because I'm jealous of him. Okay, so what about jealousy of other actors? Who are you jealous of? Who were you ever jealous of? Peter O'Toole. Why? Actually, uh, Peter O'Toole uh, kind of has a history with me. Uh, Peter did play, <clears throat> played, did the play, The Ginger Man. And Sybil Burton's, who was uh, Richard Burton's wife, uh, was running a theater, uh, or she was, she produced The Ginger Man in New York City, and she had me read for it, and I, I gave a poor reading and uh, a poor? I wasn't good enough to get it. Um, um, I can tell you who I can't remember who got it, but he was a very good actor. But um, and I was always annoyed somehow or another with Peter O'Toole because I didn't get the role that he had played. And also Peter O'Toole had a kind of a wild reputation, and he liked he and Richard Burton hit it off very well. So I guess I was kind of jealous. Were they in the show together? Yeah, they were they were in a, a show together. Um, Don't think for the title; it's you know, okay. I'll never get it. But who else are you? Have you been jealous of? You know, I don't. I'm really not even jealous of, of Peter. I don't get jealous of actors really. I, um, I, for one thing, I've never, I've, I've never resented a, a good actor watching a good actor because even if it's a role that I'm going to do, because I'm quite capable of stealing any good idea I can get. And you're, incorporate... You were about to say stealing the stage. No, no, I didn't say that. No, you never do that. I, I, but I am quite, I, I steal anything that I see in another actor that I think will work for me. So um, uh, I, 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 look, I look at actors and when they're good, I think that's an opportunity for them. Well, were you jealous of Richard? No, I, I, I wasn't. I sometimes got annoyed with Richard because, just like a lot of people got annoyed with Richard, because he didn't, he didn't go for his uh, real potential as an actor. And that, that would annoy me. And uh, That's not jealousy. No, it wasn't. Uh, uh, so I, I admired never, him. He was, boy, I'd be, I was, I've been jealous of dancers. I didn't want to change places with them, but I would be jealous of someone who had wonderful feet or high extensions, and I just wondered if that ever happened to you, jealousy. Well, I don't know whether the term jealousy, I mean, when I see a good actor, like a singer, for instance, who can, who can sing very well, I look at them and I think, oh man, I wish I could sing like that. And I, I'm, I may be envious. Okay, I'll take envy. But not... Name some people you're envious of. Well... Take uh... a deep breath. And blurt it out. It, almost, almost any. But Bob Goulet, for instance, I lo I love the way Bob sang and the voice that he had, oh, which is kind wonderful. of a wooden quality, but it was wonderful. And um, but uh, and and Richard, I was. Bob in, had a wooden quality a, as an actor, but not the wooden voice. Well, when I say wooden, it's like a like a, a rich, deep, kind oh of, oh oh, uh, like a mahogany right. quality that was wonderful. And um, uh, Richard, I was uh, envious of, of the, his ability to do thing, uh, lines, to do um, read poetry, and his uh, rhythms. Of course, I could sing better than Richard, but uh, he had a natural rhythm when it came to reading poetry and stuff like that. That I was envious of. And um, uh, even women, I've been envious of. Uh, uh, Name one. Well. 
uh, Audra McDonald, uh, that in singing. I'm trying to think, uh, or or the Canadian actress uh, um, Zoe Caldwell. Uh, oh yes, she's got some techniques and. Um, uh, the fact is, you are not either envious or jealous, John. It was an interesting question, and you passed the test. And we must be coming close to the end of our <laughs> time on the remote, or you would try to get us something, a better answer out of me. No, answer. I like what you said. Okay. I like the way you think. And I like the way she asks questions because she doesn't put me on the spot too bad. Okay. All right, well, we'll see you next week. And in the meantime, I'm going to go out and study up some good answers for whatever she asks me. But I never know what she's going to ask me. No, that's true. All right. Bye. We'll see you next week. This is AIR. See you next week.